welcome to Media One YouTube channel. This is where we help students prepare for their WASI exams. Today I'm looking at question number two, WASI 2022 private or NOPTEC as we normally call it. Let's look at the question. Mr. Jibril is four times as old as his son. Four years ago he was seven times as old as his son. In how many years will Mr. Jibril's age be twice his son's age? Okay, first of all, let Mr. Jibril's age be Y and then let the son's age be X. So let's go back to the question. Mr. Jibril is four times as old as his son. So Y is equal to 4 X. The question said four years ago. So four years ago, let's find out their ages. Mr. Jibril was Y minus 4, which implies that 4 X minus 4. And then the son was X minus 4. So if 4 years ago, so 4x minus 4 is equal to 7 times x minus 4. We then solve it for x minus 4 go to 7x minus 28. So we can group the light terms. This implies that 4x minus 7x is equal to minus 28 plus 4. So 4x minus 7x is minus 3x is equal to minus 24 y goes side by minus 3 so our x is equal to go here 8 let's go back to the question we have to find the number of years for which mr jibril's age will be twice his son's age so son's age is 8 years and then mr jibril 4 times 8 which is 32 years okay so going back to the question let's the number of years be p okay so this implies that 32 plus p be equal to 2 times 8 plus p for so this particular year that uh, the father will be twice as old as his son so let's find p 32 plus p equal to 16 plus 2p we can group the light terms 32 minus 16 be 2p minus p so we have 32 minus 16 is 16 is equal to p so for 16 years or at 16 years to come the father will be twice as old as his son okay let's see how the scoring was done okay being able to express this at the father mr jibril is four times get b1 and then setting up the equation like this this one to get m1 so when you get another m1 and final answer is a1 and finding the mr jibril's age is a1 then coming to the other aspects setting up the equation like this we are going to get so for solving we're going to get another m1 and then final answer a1 so we in all we have total of eight marks viewers thank you very much for staying with us we hope to get you more of these type of questions so next time we meet we come up with a third question bye